Well, for the second time in two nights, we're reporting more heavy and expensive machinery missing from a local business. Now, we talked with a family owned business in Riviera Beach on Friday saying $200,000 worth of trucks stolen from them. Now, a similar story coming out of Okeechobee, where a locally owned funeral home had several pieces of equipment stolen while they were at home riding out Hurricane Nicole. Tonight, WPTV's Danielle Seat spoke with the owner who says this is going to be tough to recover from. In a small town like Okeechobee, very, very close knit, um, kind of being the town undertaker, everybody knows who I am. Matthew Buxton helps families through some of their most difficult days. He owns and operates Buxton and Bash Okeechobee Funeral Home and says that he's very involved in the community. It's one of the many reasons why he's shocked someone would steal upwards of $180,000 worth of his equipment. I think with the hurricane coming in, it was just a prime time with few people out on the street, um, storm approaching, you know, under the cover of night. His staff locked up the equipment on Wednesday with Hurricane Nicole likely to impact their area. But he says shortly after they left, one of his employees noticed it was gone. Now I am down a truck. I'm down that trailer. This is equipment that my staff uses every single day. The equipment, he says, is worth a lot more to him than any insurance company would pay. The time and energy that it's going to take to ultimately try to replace that, you know, hypothetically say I get half for what everything's worth. Now I have to pony up the rest. And as a small business, I just can't take hits like that. So it makes it very, very difficult. He's offering a $2,500 reward for someone to return the equipment. But in the meantime, he says he's dedicated to the families in his community and making sure that this doesn't impact them in a time of grief. No family is going to go without. I, I, I give my word and my love for that. Reporting in Okeechobee, I'm Danielle Seed, WPTV News Channel 5.